spring is finally here, and that means it is time to add a pop of color into your life. Get rid of all the black, it's time for some brightness. Well, the easiest way to do that, of course, is with your makeup. Fitness Magazine's beauty director, Eleanor Langston, is here with all the tricks for this spring. Welcome, Eleanor. Yeah, thanks nice for having to me. Have you. Okay, we have to talk first of all about red lipstick. Yes. Because I love this trend, but my husband insists no man likes it. What okay, do you think? I think that it's great if you keep it sheer and you keep the rest of your makeup on your skin neutral because if it's if you have the eyeshadow and the um, cheek color, then it can start to look too much. But if you just keep a simple lip, keep it sheer and lightweight, mm -hmm. then I think men will like it. Okay, so it's no longer just for Christina Aguilera and Gwen exactly. Stefani. Exactly, and there's varying shades of red. Like mm -hmm. you don't have to do fire engine red. You could do poppy, or you could do a strawberry color. A bright lip doesn't have to be this like really dramatic red. So and this is just a way to add kind of yes. that vibrance into exactly. your look. Exactly, especially coming out of winter, your skin starts to look dull. This adds like a flush of color that's really bright and healthy looking on your skin. Okay, I like it. I'm not I'm not gonna listen to yeah. my husband for now, so I like the red lipstick, and I love the girl in the picture. She looks amazing. Yeah. Okay, so let's talk next eyeshadow. What is okay, the hottest color perfect. for spring? I love a green eye, and the key to making it look very sophisticated and chic and not like you're a teenager <laughs> is to keep it concentrated on the lash line, so don't go all the way up to the brow bone. Just keep it right along the lower and upper lid, and then keep your rest of your makeup neutral with um, a pink lipstick. We have this one from Maybelline, as well as um, a sheer foundation. This one's from Mary Kay. So if you do a fun color, and a fun color lasts all day, so it'll take you through night if you're working yeah. and stuff, and you don't have to touch it up as much as lips. So now we see the girl in the picture. She has blonde hair yes. and kind of greenish eyes. Now can this look go for anyone, any color? Yes, any color and any um, eye color as well. Green has a lot of gold in it, so it really makes any eye color pop. Okay. It looks really flattering. All right, well, we always hear that your skin is really the key to your whole look because it yes. can make you look younger. Totally. A luminous, dewy skin makes you look radiant, makes you look glowy, and it makes you look really healthy and young. So um, the best way to do that is we have some highlighters. This one's from NARS. It's cream-based, as well as this one from Too Faced, which is a powder. Mm -hmm. And you want to just brush it on in a sideways V from the top of your temple to the top of your cheekbone, just oh. to add a little luminosity. And another key with this okay. look is that you want to concentrate the shimmer. So you don't want, you want to pick a foundation that's matte because you don't want to shimmer all over. You'll mm -hmm. just start to look oily and So you don't and want to put this all over your face. No, just okay. keep it just to the side to the And then okay. also it's straight down the nose too is another trick that makeup artists use. Okay, gonna look yeah. all dewy. What yes. about uh, your cheeks? Yeah, for cheeks is a great way to add a pop of color, a little bit of healthy looking glow. Um, for different skin tones, if you're fair, you want to opt for um, soft pinks and mm -hmm. corals. If you're medium toned, you want to go for rose or mauve. And then if you're darker toned, you want to go for deeper plums and fuchsias. Um, and you have kind of all price points here too. Yeah, I definitely. Yeah. We have one from Physicians Formula and one from YSL. And the YSL one's a cream one, but to make it last even longer, you can put the cream on first with a brush and then go over it with the powder and that'll kind of give you that double um, punch that makes it stay on for a long time. Is that gonna make us look like her in the picture? She yeah, looks beautiful. Yeah, it is. Oh yeah, yeah. And then for your lids and um, and your lip color for that, you just want to go neutral, maybe one shade darker than your natural tone on your lips and your eyes. Okay, time to throw out all those winter shades. Yeah. Thank you, Eleanor. Thank great you tips so much. For and to find more great tips, pick up Fitness Magazine, or as always, you can go to fitnessmagazine.com. Thanks again. Thank great you. tips.